Hi, my name is Wilman Ziada, New York City-based director and creator of theater, television, and film, and also a proud Phoenix Global Artist Ambassador. Today, I'm thrilled to be speaking with the acclaimed artist and producer, T.R. Son, The Terminator. For more on T.R., you can read more about him right below the video, but before we get to my interview with him, here is just a sneak peek at the incredible talent of the one and only T.R. so much better speaking with you and I'm so excited that the audience got a little sneak peek of your talent. TR, I want to know where were you born and when did you realize that you had a musical gift? Um, I was born in the Bronx in New York uh, and I think I started playing African drums when I was like five or six maybe and I, since then I haven't stopped playing any type of music. I love it. Did you have any uh, musical inspirations growing up, whether it be certain genres or specific artists? Um, my mom was really obsessed, really, with Prince. So that was one of my really big influences. When I was a kid, I used to play a lot of different instruments, including like guitar and stuff. That's awesome. How do you feel like your early childhood influences have impacted your artistry today? Um, I think it helps me be freer with my choices as an artist. Some of the people that I really liked when I was younger that I felt were like this different category of artists, like Prince and um, or at least someone in hip hop that I thought was that way, it was Andre 3000. Um, they kind of do whatever it is that feels good to them. I, but they still do it with all the expertise that they do in their craft. And that's why it comes out good anyway, even though it's so weird and different from everyone else. Well, so I that's really that. what, I, what I bring from that. Well, you do, TR. I mean, you're, you're definitely a first-rate version of yourself, not trying to be a second-rate version of someone else. And you, you look at some of your inspirations. I mean, God, Prince is the king of that. And I'm curious to know, you know, TR, these past 18 months have been tough on all artists especially artists, all humans, but especially artists. I'm curious what you were able to do during the lockdown creatively that kind of kept your creative juices flowing. Um, I just kept making music. Uh, prior to lockdown, I used to try my hardest to work on songs every day, make beats every day. And I just really tried to be consistent with that and make sure nothing really changed in that respect and work harder to be better at my music because I didn't have to take any time. I didn't have to take that much time to practice every day because I wasn't performing. So I could work harder on getting new sounds out, like improving my voice, improving my clothes and bars and things like that until I get to 
what the product I have now versus 16 months ago when I had only one project and like maybe a single out. Yeah, well, TR, you know, you bring up a good point. I think for many artists that I've spoken with, including yourself, it was almost like within this pause, they were able to kind of really sink in and dig in to like, okay, what's my brand? And how am I going to put myself out there in a fresh new way, but with time to really think about what the brand is? If you could describe the TR brand in a few words, what would you say it is? It's really about like authenticity and self-realization. Like a lot of, uh, a lot of my life has not been particularly easy, but with some of the things that I've learned about myself over time, um, it has become easier and like accepting things about myself, then it has become easier to like have a better life and such. And I think trying to push that specific aspect of mental health, which is self-acceptance um, is really part of what I'm trying to show to everyone. It's amazing. Well, listen, um, I'm thinking about all the young TRs out there looking at you, whether it be male, female, however they may identify, but you are, uh, you're an inspiration. You're someone who's obviously done the work on themselves, done the work on their craft and continue to spread your light and your incredible talent and thank God for it. And um, I'm very grateful for your time today, TR, really, thank you. All right, cool, thanks, I appreciate it.